welcome back to the channel and today Yuzi and I are going to be having a rocket engine only dogfight where we have to build flying vehicles that use only the rocket engines not just for thrust but also for every single control so pitch and yaw and roll and all that stuff so you can use wings for lift but you cannot use flap wings for controls you cannot use gyros for controls or any gyro stabilizers all of your control has to come from the rocket thrusters and the only other limitation is a maximum of 200 blocks and that's pretty much it we're going to be cycling through a bunch of different weapons trying to shoot each other out of the sky you ready to get building using i'm ready all right let's do it all right, so we have no power core limit because these things are 20 power cores each. We just got to make it work and use um, only 100 or 200 blocks. We didn't want to be able to insulate with 10 layers of blocks to protect our thrusters. So uh, it's going to be a aerodynamically challenging vehicle because of these rocket engines. I'm going to try to build in as much thrust vectoring as I can. But this is, this is going to be legitimately challenging. This is going to be a massive vehicle just because of how big the rockets are. And that's all we can use. That's kind of the fun of it. I don't even know if I can make this look like anything reasonable. Actually, I wonder... No, I don't want it to be super small either. Because I want to be able to sustain some hits. It's been a while since we had like a normal dogfight that wasn't like EMP based. Now I'm actually going to be losing pieces. I think thrust vectoring would be good. The only downside is with thrust vectoring... I lose some redundancy because now multiple things will be dependent on the same thrusters. So if that thruster gets taken out, there's a lack of redundancy there. Maybe I should just make the whole thing out of thrusters. I don't know. I don't know how to play this. This has, the, oh my goodness, this has the potential to be such a massive build, like too massive. All right, so I really only need pitch and roll. Yaw shouldn't be that important. All right, yeah, in that case, I'm only going to use a couple of... Yeah, a couple of thrusters. These are going to be my forward thrusters. And then I'm going to just have dedicated thrusters for each control. That way, just each thruster has to get taken out to lose that control. That single control. All right, so if this is my forward thrust, I need to be able to roll. And that has to be centered. This is going to be like an actual, an actual nightmare. <laughs> this would be my roll. How do I roll? I... I Thrust vectoring would be the simplest way to do roll, but it lacks redundancy. Maybe I just gotta deal with it. Maybe I just gotta do the, uh, the thrust vectoring. It's just once one of them gets shot off, I'm done. Not only that, but then if I have these here, look at the aerodynamics. I will be so slow. Oh, the aerodynamics on this side of them is actually pretty decent. No, I can still have redundancy. Ooh, oh, okay, this could work. I can have thrust vectoring on dedicated roll thrusters so these can also go in line but then these are going to be the ones that are responsible they will give me extra forwards uh moment or forwards thrust but then these will be the ones that thrust vector maybe everything thrust vectors i just build redundancy into the thrust vectoring okay okay it's starting to come together now i may not have room for wings on this thing unless i do a biplane my plane could work but yeah like uh technically if i add wings to the edges of these for like tail fins uh the thrust vectoring will also be using the fins as aid and i don't think that would be qualifying within the rules unless oh, i could add something coming out here and then behind this potentially all right there's potential other places to add wings all right there we go now i got pitch and then i got roll the only thing is the uh, pitch is dependent on these logic gates. So if these logic gates get shot off, then I no longer have them, which is why I'm going to hide them under my cockpit because you have to get through my cockpit to get to my logic. All right, now I've got these sideways ones, which are also going to help with roll. Uh, pitch is another story, though. Let's actually just see how this thing flies right now. Oh my goodness, this is so fast. Oh, wait, we don't have any aerodynamics. Uh, but this is working. And then ready, roll. Oh, wow. Okay. It's here in, in theory. In theory, we got we got some things going that are good and also bad. I'm only at 30 blocks. Like, I don't know. It's so big already. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do with 200 blocks. So I was going to do a little bit of a life hack for these rockets here. Since these rockets have like a three second ramp up, um, if you have an output of like... 0.02 just a little bit of output going to all of the rockets it keeps them oops it keeps them activated so that they uh it overrides the ramp up but it doesn't like apply any power as you can see 
But then, uh, when we press space to apply power, we start already ramped up. Oh my goodness. All right, so for vertical stabilization, I am going to use a big elevator fin, but I'm going to remove the controls so I don't break any rules here. And then I will use this tail fin like that. I think that's going to look good. There we go. Now, my problem is if this engine gets taken out, this whole tail gets taken out. So I need some redundancy in connection so that this thing is just not a fragile little tail. All right, I think this does it here. So now it's attached to this engine and it is attached down here as well. All right, now let's see how this feels. All right, a lot more stable. However, oh, the tail is too strong. It overrides my pitch ability. It just keeps me too stable. All right, I might not actually want something like that. Um, hmm, I'm gonna put these in here instead. A little bit less extreme. All right, let's see how this feels. All right, so see, I can't pitch. I literally cannot, I cannot pitch right now. All right, what if it is just these tail fins then? Like, I feel like we need some type of drag or stability, but this is too much. All right, I think what, I, what I'm missing is lift in the front. So my center of mass is there, and now my center of lift, because I have no other lift. Uh, this is hard. All right, so even with it, like, pitch is so bad right here, and it is just because of the, the wings just fight it so bad. Um, but I added a little function here, so if I press space, all of the thrusters activate, but if I roll, just those front two will activate with the roll, so that way I can, like, I can slow down without adding too much force, without trying to trigger all the thrusters in order to roll, because if I take away the thrust, I can't roll. Um... I don't have any control surfaces or any like pitch or roll without the thrust activating, but I don't want all of them active all of the time because that's just too much. I just need to figure out how to pitch, but also have directional stability. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, all, all, right, all of a sudden things are weird. I think I need more thrust on the front. Ugh. I'm also going to add the pitch to this. The front and the back thrusters are going to coincide with each other for pitch, so they tilt up the front and tilt down the back. And as you can see, it is having an effect oh my goodness but it's a bad like it's it's too much too much is happening right now oh this is so hard to control this is way harder than i was expecting it to be right, if i get rid of these what happens oh oh i still can't pitch it's like having a right, what happens if i just don't have a horizontal stabilizer i need directional stability yeah see now all right now look what's happening though like now this happens all right look at this Look at this little tail right here. Oh, this isn't bad. This is actually not too bad. Like, it's not as it's not as agile as I would want it to be. But I stable I stabilize. What if I put some modular wings right here? I need weapons on this thing. I need weapon areas. Swap out some weapons and um maybe slightly I don't know. I need to provide some type of protection. Some shielding but it's gonna be hard because these are moving pieces. So I have to make sure that there's no collision issues. Oh, whoa, what happened? That's bad. That's bad. I tried to pitch down and that happened. I feel like uh, I need more central wings that are resistant to ro uh, roll. All right, I think I've gotten somewhere where it's more stable, but okay, well now it just did that. It wasn't doing that this whole time. And then it just, okay. But I can kind of hold the pitch sometimes and have some maneuverability. Other times it's a little bit slower. Like you see, it's a little bit of a, well, it's actually pretty decent. That's pretty decent. I can deal with that. That amount of pitch I can deal with. But now I still have to protect everything. So we'll see what happens. All right, I went a little overboard and I'm at like at 190 blocks now, but I created, I don't know why I did it around here. I mean, there's thrusters here, but there's also my cockpit but I feel like the tail is even more vulnerable, but uh, I think this looks super cool at least. Look at this. Uh, aerodynamically not great, but with the amount of power I have, doesn't really matter. And it doesn't seem to affect me too much. So I think I've at least, I've accomplished something in the realms of form. I don't know if the function is there, but it's pretty cool in my opinion. All right, then I think I'm just going to add some shielding to this tail area, which might be vulnerable to attacks. If one of these blocks gets taken out, uh, this whole thing gets taken out. So that's also not good. I think I'm pretty vulnerable. I don't think I did well, but we'll find out when we get in the air. Let's paint this thing up and see what Yuzi came up with.
All right, Scrap, have you finished your uh, rocket-powered aircraft? I finished something. It is definitely a <laughs> rocket-powered craft. Uh, how long it stays in the air, we'll find out. You want to see it? Yeah, let's see it. All right, here it is. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> so, wow. uh, it is, I used five rockets and I used complete thrust vectoring. Uh, so I actually can't use a thrust vectoring without triggering them, but, uh, you can kind of oh, get the idea. Oh, okay. Um, I am not that maneuverable, uh, but if I was any more maneuverable, I'd be out of control. I have two sets of thrusters <laughs> on the front and two in the back that will both pitch and roll me. Okay. And then my right. middle one in the back is just for forward boost. So I'm hoping I can lose a thruster or two and still have control. Like I was trying to build redundancy into my control systems so that one thruster wasn't responsible for like a, a whole entirety of a control. And then I just added a whole bunch of shields around these thrusters in my cockpit. So I don't know if that's going to help, but uh, it looks cool. <laughs> it looks cool, right? Uh, right? It looks cool. Yeah, it's very cool. Yeah. <laughs> you right. get points there. Wow. All right. Yes, yeah, so that's my craft. So I'm curious what yours looks like. Okay. Let me show you mine. Here it is. Wow. It actually looks real like a real thing <laughs> yes um this thing is huge so uh how many I mean, thrusters I'm, do you have i believe i have i can see like a bunch is hidden in there there's three on the back and then there's some in the middle i have oh. yeah, six wow i'm so surprised you're able to hide that stuff in there i wanted to protect them because yeah, I, pretty... I have no idea how you made something look this good with that many thrusters like i was <laughs> like I'm, everything's exposed on mine wow and you got wings works. that fold yeah, so it's a swept wing. Uh, I have the roll and pitch all in the same uh, rockets there at the back. So I was going to take out those two rockets and then uh, no more control uh, for you. Well, yeah, <laughs> pretty much, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully they're going to be uh, not too hard to target. So in the swept mode, um, it's like it kind of keeps me stable in a straight trajectory. But when I open the wings, I get that like really floaty effect to do oh, some sharp yeah. turning. That's pretty cool. So hopefully I can uh, use both to my advantage. Well, you ready for our first battle with the smart cannons? Yeah, let's do it. All right, Party I'm getting in up air. in the let's air. Go. How fast do you go forward? Six thrusters. Ooh, I've, I've not even tested my speed. I'm at like 235 is my max. 240, nearly 250. Just surpassed two. Yeah, 260 miles per hour. That's crazy. Oh, wow. You got the speed on me. All right, you ready? I'm ready. All right, three, two, one, battle. We're going to pass each other so fast. <laughs> yeah. I'm just trying to keep this thing uh, stable. <laughs> right. Man, I'm going to lose something. I feel like I'm just going to lose something and be done. Oh, my goodness. You're so far. Your little Yo, tiny I dot. See, see the number going down. All right. Ooh. Oh, how, you damaged my central back thruster. How did that, how is that even possible? <laughs> That's like that was the farthest thing from, from where you were facing. Uh-oh. I don't know if I have... I don't know who's more maneuverable. It looks like you are with your swept wings. <laughs> uh oh, I'm having some trouble here. Oh boy. Oh, here we go. Here we go. All right, he's behind me. This is very high speed. It's been a while <laughs> since we've had just like a regular dog fight. Well, not if this isn't really regular, but like for as far as weapons go. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I keep pressing to uh, to use like yaw controls because I'm so used to building things with yaw. There's no yaw on this. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Come on. Uh oh. Whoa! Ooh. I thought we were gonna hit there. Me too. Oh man, I am damaged all over the place. Oh. Oh, you so knocked quick. out one of my thr you knocked out yeah one of my thrusters. Are you damaged at all? Uh, yes, I am. Uh, I'm holding up pretty well, but it's like under my belly. Oh, interesting. That's an interesting place to get. We have damage. Come on. Uh oh. Ooh. I have got. That was, that was my central back thruster. Oh, okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. I can't pitch. You, I don't have enough pitch. You're going down. No. Are you going down? Yes. Oh, I'm down. <laughs> All yeah. right. Apparently, nice. you need to take out two thrusters, and I no longer have enough control to overcome my tail stabilization. Uh, Well, I think since we have so many weapons to go through, let's just move right on to the miniguns. All right. My miniguns have been installed. So let's get in the air. Round two. Three, two, one. Here we go. Here we go. Woo. Ooh. Well, that's why the bottom of you has been damaged. Because you keep passing over the top of me. Ooh. Come on. Oh, dang. Oh. Okay, I'm going to have to use my speed. Right, okay, here we go. There we go. Yes. A lock. Ooh. Ooh. You really damaged two of my thrusters. You hit my minigun there. Uh-oh. 
We lose oh. our weapons, we're out, right? Uh, yeah, if you can't shoot, then yeah, you're out. Yeah, gotta be careful, because mine are quite exposed. Uh-oh. That's what weird. Happened? There's a... Something... Huh. There's an issue happening with my controls that I thought I fixed, but it's uh, no longer fixed. I, I know how to get around it, but it's fine. Good for me. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh no, oh, I just that's lost something. two thrusters and I think that's all I need to be, yep, uncontrollable. Dang, man, my thrusters are just way too exposed. I don't know how yeah. you hit them so well. Kind of lucky there. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, we're moving on to uh, blaster is next. I don't that's know, right. I, I don't even know if I stand a chance with this thing. <laughs> now these blasters do a lot of damage. They do. Oh, never mind. I didn't mess up my controls. You shot off the logic gate that uh, was responsible oh. for it. Because like, why does it work now? All right, three, two, one, go. Here we go. Blast around. I don't think I'm going to last long on this one. Oh, you keep getting Ooh. my back rear thruster and one of my left middle thrusters every single time. I don't know why. Definitely think my weak spot personally is behind me. So if you can... Managed to get behind me. There we go. Ooh, Ooh, man. Yeah, I feel like one more pass by and I'm done. Ah. Ooh, close. I am damaged. I will let. Oh, no. Yeah, my, my right engine, the one that's giving me pitch and roll, is mm. glowing. Yeah, most of my engines are glowing now. It's just a matter of time. Yep, this might be the time. Oh, I took Ooh, off something. Oh, the wing! <gasps> no! I took off a whole wing? Oh, come on, can I recover? No, no, oh, I'm down. I actually wow. got a win. I was not expecting to get a win. <laughs> Took my wing off. I thought it was going to be a clean sweep. <laughs> All right, I'll be some on the board. We have rockets, EMPs, and potentially the large cannons. I don't know. the. Oh, the large cannons. They do have aim. I don't know if they have enough aim for a dogfight, though. <laughs> Yeah, true. <laughs> yeah. All right, so let's do rockets and then EMPs. So rockets, I actually, rockets tend to be the game changer. It can even out some weaknesses sometimes. So I'm curious if this is going to help or hurt me. All right, nice. I have my rockets on separate controls. All right, scrap. Three, two, one. Here we go. Rocket round. All right. Whoa. Oh, that, that was, was pretty, too okay. close. Yeah, that was, oh, everything was close there. <laughs> oh, oh, you took nice. off my uh oh oh you took off my entire tail. That's all of my directional stabilization is gone now. I'm I'm a rocket. I'm like I'm just like a <laughs> rocket in the air right now. Oh, you're so unstable now. It's I know. Hits you. I mean, it's gonna be hard to hit me, and I can turn a lot sharper, but it's just harder to control my turns. Oh, oh no. what? Wait, did you hit yourself? I might have. Yes. Uh oh. <laughs> I was like, no way my rockets actually hit you. Okay, um, I'm down to one rocket. Shoot. <laughs> where, where are your rockets located? How did you even hit yourself? I don't know. I, just, I guess they were just aiming into me when I locked onto you. Come on. Just one more hit. <laughs> oh. Oh, I'm in a flat spin. Ooh. Uh oh. Come on, get a hit. Oh, no way. Oh, we're like both super <laughs> chaotic right now. This is an elegant dance. Yep. Oh, man. It's so tough. Where are you? There you are. Ooh, that was close. Oh, these are getting so close. Ooh, I got a oh, hit. Oh, no. I actually got a hit. What did I get? Oh, uh, that's my wing. Wow. Oh, I just tied it up. You I did. just tied it up. I can't. There's no I'm like, way. What? I'm better without my tail. <laughs> I really thought I had you there. Yeah. All right. It's going to come down to the EMP. It is. I EMP honestly... Is the and that's also round. like... I could, I could completely change the game as well. I'm kind of worried now because you can potentially just control my swept wings for me. Oh, that's true. <laughs> Final battle. EMP only. Ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. Uh-oh. All right. I'm hit. I hit you? Oh. My shields, my shields on the steering <laughs> hinges are doing weird things. Because I have a bunch of steering hinges on my shields. You keep shaping them in different ways. That was interesting. I'll try and hit you again. Ooh. Did oh, did I get you? Oh, you did. What's it doing? I, I'm not sure. <laughs> Is that a whoa, hit? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's my, that's my rocket engines. Oh, I can't get on you right now. Can you knock my tail off real quick? <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, there we go. 
Um, yeah, my thruster's doing something weird. I don't have enough I'm definitely control. staying on you. Yeah. I don't, I'm not sure if I'm hitting you, though. Might be a little fast. I haven't got a lock on you in so long. All right, we might need to take it over to the land a little bit more. Okay, we're gonna have some obstacles and terrain. Yep. <laughs> Are you like intentionally slowing down? Cause it's making <laughs> me confused. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm trying to get over to the land, but I'm not trying to be like a sitting duck just with you behind me. All right, here we go. Oh, I got a lock, but they missed. It might be pretty balanced here. Yeah, I don't know. it's hard I don't to feel say. Like any significant interruptions happening. Uh-oh. Whoa, that was close. Ooh. I just have such terrible... Uh oh there I have we such go. terrible roll or pitch. The EMPs aren't that effective here. <laughs> oh, whoa! You've turned uh -oh. my wing, like, inverted. Oh, really? Ah. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, it's uh -oh. back, it's back. Oh, that was, that was the closest one yet. Man, I just can't get on your tail anymore. Yeah, I'm really trying to stay behind you, knock you out of the sky. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Pitch up, pitch up, pitch up. Oh! Okay, I'm Is this going to be a self-made error? No. Oh, Almost. Mind. Almost. I keep looking up in the sky and not seeing how low I am. Come on. <laughs> get a log. Uh-oh. No, that's a good hit. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, that, oh everything's, oh, everything's yeah, going. Oh, yeah, there we go. There we go. Yes, yes, no. yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I had yeah. control. I had no control over anything there. That was epic. Yeah, I think every <laughs> single one of my uh, thrust vectors were like just taken over by the EMP. <laughs> Man, wow, that was uh, that was like one of our closest battles yet. That was pretty close. Yeah. Oh, yep. Uh, I just that was a good progression enemies. having um, an uneven number, an odd number of weapons to go through. So we had a tiebreaker at the end. All right. Well, um, I guess. What was it? Yeah, this one was just random idea, just rockets only. And uh, that was definitely a lot more challenging to build a craft than I was expecting. So if anybody has any other crazy ideas or challenges or restrictions to do for some battles or dog fights or anything else, let us know down in the comments below. And if you guys enjoyed this video, you'll probably enjoy some more that you can find right here on the end screen. Hope the video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.